get another one. Yep, one. That's two. That's three. Oh, two more, and then the team's gone. Let's go. Let's go. Time for the golden. Time for the golden move. Let's go. Let's go. There it is. All right. All right. We're claiming it. We're claiming it. All right. Seeing everything happening. Okay. Where are my teammates at? What are they doing? What are they doing? What are they doing? Hey. Let's go. Let's go. Helicopter on deck. Let's go. That's hardcore for you right there. That's what's up. Yup. Yup. That's what it is. Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to a Call of Duty video. You are about to see something lit. For the most part, you guys are going to lock in. If you guys are watching me for the first time, plug me in, play the game, and watch me do what I do best. But for the most part, enjoy what you are seeing as open world content when you guys are playing Domination. This is about to be a fun little scenario type. I hope you guys enjoyed the clip at the beginning. For the most part, that was pretty lit. I was able to get the golden gun after that. And that was going to be the camo that's going to be on top of the gun that makes it look golden. I was able to get that and achieve it. I'm happy that I was able to do it for the most part. And follow the instructions given throughout the menu. For the most part, we're going to lock in. I'm going to show you exactly how we do this. It's not going to be easy because the first part is we have to conquer all platforms between A, B, and C. And most of the chances you might not have somebody who wants to claim those areas, you know what I mean? And want to take charge of just claiming them because claiming them means you have to sacrifice your body in initially to get that spot, right? If you can do it, then most definitely you are very MVP like ish um, kind of a player in this scenario type of domination. Domination is not one of those easy scenario types where anybody can just come up and thinking that they're going to get a win. If you have a solid group and you can possibly do it, it's going to make you guys much more better understanding um, positioning and where you want to claim. Do you want to claim? Uh, a or B or do you want to get all three or do you want to just claim one but surprisingly you get points on the board for claiming as much as you possibly can uh, two is better than one and three is better than zero so you want to be able to claim two at a time and hold down those positionings and make your odds actually turn into winning odds for the most part this is not something that's going to be easy again. I can't just walk up in here thinking that I'm going to claim to win this. And actually being the lead hand charge holding down the group. I got to shoot people off nodes. I got to make sure that I'm collecting. And then I'm going to have to make sure that I'm defending and still getting kills and not dying as much times as possible. The most part, most people can't do this. And I don't really look for their help. That's not, I'm not looking for their help. I'm looking for people who know what they're doing. I'm not looking for help. Help is for the weak. I'm not looking for help. I'm looking for people who know what they're doing. That is what I'm playing like. For the most part, some of these guns' abilities to make you disappear off the map, they're pretty legit. You know what I mean? I, I actually got to like it for the most part because if I was in it, claiming it, I would enjoy exactly what I'm looking at. Claiming it, you know what I mean? For the most part, some of these guns just do normal things. They just explode or they just hit you and then you just die. Some, some of them actually make you, like, vanish into, like, basically uh, fogs of smoke or even turn into rose petals. You know what I mean? Um, but for the most part, man, you, you watching a guy streamer, plug me in, play me, watch me, play me, watch me, play me, watch me. Just do it. I'm, I'm telling you, you ain't going to regret it. You ain't going to regret it. For the most part, dying is a part of this game that happens to everybody. If you don't understand exactly why you're going down, it's because you're not understanding what scenario type you're in. For the most part, the scenario type I'm in, I'm trying to defend and capture and still at the same time keep the peace between the balance between A, B, and C. So those scenario types are going to be my objective and that is basically when you go in here, you got to know what you're doing. You know what I mean? For the first time, most people don't explain exactly what you're supposed to be doing. And sometimes the game does explain exactly what you're supposed to do. But domination is when you collect all three of them 
and basically they have no notes so they're gonna be spawning around the map looking to collect something and the first thing they're gonna do is trying to collect so you have to make sure you are knowing what you're doing some guns require you to clinch onto something like what i'm doing mounted and actually get some kills i'm doing everything that i'm performing that i have learned in the past and still doing it today till this day in the future to make things possible you know what i mean these are type of things that you need to have to do and understand the capability of your level of understanding call of duty um it's not just a running gun game where you can just shoot everything and you're gonna get everything by just shooting everything it doesn't work like that you actually have to read what you actually have to do with these guns to break through the next scenario type get another attachment uh help yourself get another lens um being able to get another camera you know what i mean most people don't tell you this and i and i and i'm not going to be that type of person that doesn't tell you this but being in those scenario types will make your game so much more better um i'm not someone who really needs tedious help i need people who know what they're doing that's what I need. I don't need people. People need me. You know what I mean? And when I say this, it's not me being confident and cocky. Listen to what I'm saying. I know what to do. I didn't come in here with a group. I came in here with randoms to get the win. You know what I mean? That is what I came in here to do. I didn't come here to fool around with you. I. It's like me saying this. If you a girl, drop your panties and get it moving. Like, I'm not playing with you. I'm not here to play no fun little game with you and say hey let's let's do it no i'm here to get the win and just cut that's it you know what i mean i'm not here to be buddy buddy with you unless you know you want the ring you know what i mean and unless that I, I still have to choose it you know what i mean look in my eyes and look deeply in my eyes i'm not playing with you i have no time for you you know what i mean so you already see me i already spent up all the way to the top and i'm trying to show you guys this is what leaders do we're not supposed to follow somebody at the bottom. We're not supposed to. So, for the most part, we're gonna lock in and show you exactly how we're gonna do this and dominate. For most parts, we dominated the area for probably like 45 seconds to a minute. And we locked in and we were able to do it. And pretty much, that team is having problems. We're doing good and they're having problems. But the joke is, I want you guys to realize exactly how positioning works. I'm playing defense right now. We have two and they have one. Their points is not moving fast enough to capture one. It's like taking two steps, uh, uh, one step forward, two steps back. You're not going to make it. You know what I mean? You can keep doing the math and the math is going to keep on subtracting every single time. So you have to make a bigger differential. You have to be claiming those areas that's all you got to do that's all you got to do clean those areas um for the most part i like the f a l gun i think this is what it's called they always be shaping and changing the names of these guns i don't know why and i like the f a l gun you know what i mean this is i think this is it or it could be a replica um, I'm not too sure exactly if this is replica or the same one, but it feels the same like the last Call of Duty that I've been playing in the past, and we're up by a big margin, 155 to 74. That is a big margin, and I'm leading the campus of kills, dominating, captures, and defense. I'm doing it all. You know what I mean? So you're already seeing domination at its finest. I'm giving you the best content that a content creator can give you from a point of view of actually playing. And I will lock and tell you, always watch your areas, always watch your surroundings, always listen to the surroundings, always understand how and where they can actually spawn. So if you're spawning on one end, imagine if you were spawning on the opposite team. You know, think for yourself when it comes down to like securing a W. Think if you were standing here, they might be on the opposite side. You know what I mean? And you guys gotta see, I'm taking one shot after one shot after one shot. I'm not shooting. I'm not letting off a hundred rounds. You know what I mean? I'm letting you guys know. All the angles is very important because all the angles will secure a shot going through. You gotta always remember a bullet is really small but packs a punch. You know what I mean? So you gotta be able to utilize some logic when it comes down to really doing it and actually 
utilizing it in the game. That is the same scenario type, you know what I mean? And as long as you're gonna shoot him straight, it's basically based on your accuracy to hit the targets if it's straight. You know what I mean? Nothing moves unless you're moving on him, you know what I mean? So, um... I'm happy to give you another piece of content. I just want you guys to like lock in and play and, and just watch, just in general. Like, you know what I mean? Headshot, <laughs> a lot of the, another hit, you know what I mean? Get enough of those and I'm unlocking a lot of stuff. So, you know what I mean? Those things that you need to do is just basically what it is. I'm sorry, you know what I mean? As, as much as my team, you know, the game is dirty. You know what I mean? If you get really, 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 really sad and um, but you gotta keep moving and persevering, you know what I mean? As, as a soldier in the game, understanding what this is, people get put on Earth to do certain things, and then they get to leave Earth after their job is done. I don't think my job is done here, so you know what I mean? There's a lot going store in the near future for what the future holds in my future. You know what I mean? I can't be talking about somebody else's future and their future timeline came to an end. Um, as much as it might be sad, it hurts me because I've been so close to um, this gun stuff. You know what I mean? But... As I might see, you know what I mean? It's a part of life, you know what I mean? It's what keeps countries together, safe, all these things. And you could say a bunch of things about it, but as much as the negative, you don't want anybody who you love to get hurt with one, you know what? But but in a game scenario type, hopefully it shows people how scary and how easy a body could be here and gone after in a matter of seconds, you know what I mean? So I just want you guys to realize that I'm doing this for the sake of the team. And the sake of the game of trying to compete on a level where competitive, competing, like competing is a part of life. You know what I mean? It literally is a part of life. So I want you guys to realize again, you guys are watching one of the biggest, best streamers out here when it comes down to vice versa, different game playing styles, when it comes down to winning. I do this on the regular. There's nothing that I don't do. You know what I mean? So get right, get real, and keep it X rated. And remember, Stay straight, no boxing on. Stay straight.